my darling wife. I am sending you this letter, albeit voicemail, but letters sound more charming, to let you know that I shall not be returning for many a night. This is not a secret. Of course, you are aware I'm leaving, but it seems more difficult than anticipated. I chose to forego the crew. They were too demanding, expected me to sit back and, and not do anything. I cannot sit back in my own story. I am a narrator, hero, and antagonist. Therefore, it seems rather silly to lie below dock alone the whole time. I am knowledgeable of sailing and aware of my own fault. I know this is a dangerous game, but Opal, you must see. The ocean is breathtaking. There is a sort of magic to being alone at sea. Part of me wants to take up shanties. Could you imagine me, a little pirate? I'll learn the one Pim sings when she plays video games. With a drunken sailor. With a drunken sailor. With a drunken sailor. In the morning. Just to clarify, I am a sober sailor. I love you. I'll update you as soon as possible. Yours forevermore. Indy. My intrepid Pim. I am missing you! I've spent much of my time while there's still signal on my phone looking up sea shanties. I have learned most of the words to Drunken Sailor, though from website to website it says they're different. Um, I imagine the nature of a shanty. I tried to learn whiskey in a jar, but I didn't really. Uh, I did learn William Taylor. And my love, how do you get these songs out of your head? It's like earworms, constantly a buzz. As I said, I'm missing you. And Opal, too. The sun shines, and I don't see any rain on the horizon. Darling, the star shell is within my grasp. I know it. Yours forevermore, Indy. <laughs> Guardians of my heart. I do not know when you will hear from me again. I'm traveling into unknown lands. And by unknown, I mean I am lost. But only for a moment. I called the house phone, so hopefully you will both check the recorder. It is lonely. I am safe. I have more than enough granola, and the weather is sunny skies all around. Think of your strange little pirate as I venture further into the unknowable. They think of you. Yours forevermore. Indy. What you have just heard is Dr. Indigo Hale's correspondence with their wife and girlfriend prior to their exploits on a mysterious island for a mysterious adventure. Intrigued? Check out more at the Museum of Mysteries newest audio exhibit, Deep Blue Stars, donated by Seraphim Feldman Rodriguez and Opal Hale, and generously underwritten by the Lavender Lemonade Collective. Find it past the gift shop on the right on your favorite podcatcher app on July 29th.